lesson we're going to look at Jerusalem Ridge, the basic melody. Uh, this song plays out of the key of A minor and uh, so you're going to get very comfortable and familiar with an A minor scale. Okay, played on the D and the G string. Um, so let's go ahead and start in and uh, you'll see right off that uh, we use that quite a bit. Usually I'll start this song off with four chops. Uh, first finger on the D string and the G string, just barred across. So you're playing a fifth chord right there. Okay, and so I'll just, in time with the music, set the tempo. Okay, there are other ways to start it, but that's a good simple start to this. Um, so let's break down the first few phrases. I'll play them and then uh, we'll get into them note for note. Okay, so it starts off, um, you're going to walk up from your first finger on the G string up to a first finger on the D string. Can you pause right there? And it's a low three on your walk up. That's what makes it minor. Okay, now. Okay, so we're up bow slur. And then down. So you go down to your third finger and back up to your first. Okay, putting those two phrases together. And we're back in to starting that same phrase, the first one again. And we do it just pretty much note for note. All right, in this lesson we're going to look at an advanced melody for Jerusalem Ridge. Um, so we'll build on that basic. Uh, we're going to do a lot of droning on this and some double stops, um, some trills. So um, we're, we're going to get started similar to the way that we looked at the first part, the uh, basic melody, which was four chops. OK, 
Okay, but I'm going to add in those three at the end. Okay, so just adding kind of one in between the last, um, the third and the fourth chop. So that's the first time through. The, you can also rock over there. Okay, or make a full A minor chord. So you're going to add on your C natural and your A note here. Okay, if you do it quick enough, you can almost make it sound like you're hitting four notes at the same time. Okay, it requires you to rock your bow across as you do your chop. Okay, um, just something to work on, not necessary to start the song out. So let me play through the first part and I'll add in some of the extra stuff that we'll work through and then we'll break those down. Okay, so starting out, you can do a hammer on right there, not all the time, but uh, hammer on from an open D to a one E note. Okay. Okay, right there you can do a, a trill. So that is two one two one open. So you can practice that as a separate exercise. Okay, so the turnaround. And go down to an E flat there with your first finger to blues it a little bit. I wouldn't do that all the time, although I think I did in the performance video. Um, but that's a nice touch to put in the key.